hit sunset, twilight, and it is hot. It's probably like 80 degrees right now. And it's going to be like this all the way until, uh, uh, probably until about October. Yeah, of course, uh, here in Phoenix, we don't really get upset about the heat. Wow, some noisy cars. We don't get upset about the heat until it reaches like 110, 115 degrees. Yeah, so it's pretty cool. Uh, the one thing that uh, causes a lot of the heat in Phoenix is the, uh, the asphalt. It absorbs the heat of the sun during the day, and then it uh, re-admits the heat at night. Uh, that's the reason, for, for example, if you go outside the city limits, you know, like maybe 30 minutes outside, uh, you'll notice the desert actually kind of gets kind of cool at night, and that's because there's no asphalt. One of the things that uh, Phoenix has actually started doing is they've been uh, using uh, recycled tires and mixing it up in the asphalt. It actually has an unexpected side effect. Uh, they originally started doing it, just it's something to do with the old tires, but they found that the, uh, the, uh, the, the recycled rubber in the asphalt actually makes the roads cool down a lot quicker. Now, of course, this here is standard, regular asphalt, but they've been putting it on the freeways, and any time they do new paving, they're paving with this new kind of asphalt. So hopefully in about 10 years, once new asphalt's been laid down all over the city, it won't be as uh, hot at night. Another thing they're doing on uh, new construction is they're using light-colored roofing tiles. And this is also to do the same thing, uh, to uh, not absorb so much heat, but basically just you know bounce it right back during the daytime, and that way it makes nighttime a lot cooler. But anyway, uh, I'm here at the uh, the bus stop, and I'm just uh, waiting to get to work, and uh, the bus will be showing up pretty soon. And here we go. Oh, another cool, fascinating fact before I go. Arizona does not celebrate daylight savings time. It's the same time all year round. But anyway, I'm the Happy Kenny, and thanks for watching.